Now to a must-do for lovers of art. The Arts Longmont Studio Tours allow you to explore the studios of over 50 artists. It's a unique and beautiful opportunity to visit artists and see their work in the very places they are actually creating their masterpieces. I'm joined by Marianne Lorenz, Executive Director of Arts Longmont, as well as we have artist um, Ambrosia, Angelo Ambrosia, and also Joan Jordan. Thank you for being with us. Your art is so beautiful. Look at the fall piece. And this would be very careful of. Yes, we Do are not touch. Like I know it. Um, what was the beginning of this, the genesis of this event? Well, first of all, I, to preface it, you know, Longmont has an incredible um, number of really great artists. Mm -hmm. It's really sort of a hub for artists. I didn't know that. Yes. It, we were just talking about this yeah. before the show. And in 2000, they gathered together and said, you know, we really want to find a way to connect not only to one another, but also to the community. So they started the Arts Longmont Studio Tour in 2000 mm -hmm. and um, um, opened it up. It's a, you know, something that everyone can participate in and see artists working in their studios. So what can people expect? I mean, everything, let's say I'm not really into art, but it's creative, it's beautiful, relaxing. It's creative, it's beautiful. Yeah, it, is all it doesn't matter. <laughs> and it does take place on September 23rd and 24th from 11 to 5. And on, on each of those days, so you can, you know, go about it in a leisurely way, there will be 57 artists in 36 different spaces. Mm. And you'll be able to go, and in some cases, you'll just see the, sh the work displayed. Mm -hmm. And in other cases, the artist will actually be working or be working in their studio. So it's something for everyone. It is, and you can buy directly from the artist. So Ooh, that's a fun experience. That's even right? better, yes. And um, watching them work, watching the process, all media. Of, as, as you can see, we have a glass blower, we have painters. Probably um, um, ceramics. Ceramics, pottery, potters, yes. jewelry. You name it, we've yes. got it. <laughs> now, Joan, you're the painter yes. of the beautiful works of art. Over here. Um, how did you become interested in something like this? Well, always? Always. Always. Yes. I had um, a grandfather who was a painter, and I can remember from being a little kid just being out there painting with him. Is that part of your inspiration? Yes, Starting definitely. With that? Um, how do you get your subjects to paint? Like, what do you decide? Uh, well, I love being outdoors. Okay. Hiking in the mountains. I grew up on the ocean in Maine. Mm. So I have always been an outdoor person. So that's nature. Yes. What do you like about this event? It's a really great way to show a full range of my work. Instead mm -hmm. of being in a gallery where you have three or four pieces, you get to show a whole body of work. And some people like the older ones, mm -hmm. some people like newer ones, so you get to have a variety. And I would get, meet a lot of people mm -hmm. and their meet interests. Meet people, yeah. Now, Angelo, this work here is beautiful to the glass the glasswork that you do, um, give people a deeper understanding of, of your craft and how you have that, that vision. Oh. <laughs> it's like, how do you go from, you know, get this? It's amazing. Well, you could come to the Longmont Studio Tour and see how you we make it stuff. All. Yeah. Do yeah. you draw things out first? Where do you get your ideas? Yeah, everything is planned. I, I is planned it? out most everything I make. Um, I work with a team, so I have to tell everybody what we're going to be doing and, mm -hmm. and explain the process and things like that. Of so. all the different things, why glass? Oh, I love glass. Look at the colors. Is it the and color? And the, the fluidity of the glass. The actual medium itself is so much fun to work with. Um, oh, it really that. keeps you in the, me in the moment. And um, yeah, uh, it's, you know, it's, it's hard to beat, I think. You um, make it's it very sound active. so easy. It's very active. And it's been a hot summer. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. so we sweat a lot, but it's a lot of fun, and, and we'll be making things during the tour, and um, so you'll be able to see. They're going to see um, this? Can they yeah. see the workshop and how this oh, is yeah, done? Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll be working the whole time, and, huh. um, yeah. And each piece is unique, like this one, for example, that is so delicate. Um, how long does something like this take? Oh, well, that particular piece takes... It, it takes a few day, or a few hours from when I start gathering the glass to when I finish. There are some parts I make, pre-make parts, okay. so that I can uh, get the process to go a little faster once I start. Because mm -hmm. once we start, we have to finish the piece, basically. Mm -hmm. So if we work on a piece for five or six hours, oh, we have to keep that thing turning and hot the whole time. So the it's, it's very physical and active. So 
Wow, um, it's beautiful, beautiful. Now, do you have a studio? Do you have an area? No, I'm an art historian, so not have, an artist. Okay, <laughs> so do you have any studio space at all, or do you? Um, Arts Longmont does not have that's studio what it space. Is, and you kind of coordinate we have everything. a gallery where gallery. we where we show and sell art, but we don't have an actual studio. And, there. But Joan, you do, right? Yes. You have kind of your I own have space in my basement. I've set it oh. up with a full fin unfinished basement, so I can be messy. I can love that. Have multiple projects going at once and um, it's Relaxing. really nice. What about you Angela? Don't you find, I mean, creative people, it's kind of a way to relax. But your workshop, your space seems <laughs> kind of intense. Yeah, the heat is intense, on. Yeah. But you still, don't you find that that's where your creative juices really yeah, start? Yeah, it becomes kind of a meditation because it, it demands that focus from you. Um, so, yeah, yeah. You, you forget. You forget that it's hot. And, Everything just melts like away. That. Yeah. Life is great. Well, thank you so much for sharing. Thank you. And the insight about the Arts Longmont Studio Tour. Studio Tour. Yes. The Arts Longmont, as we just said, Studio Tours takes place September 23rd and 24th from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. It's a self-guided tour that will take you into the creative spaces that brings art to life. Meet artists. You can be inspired and learn more. Head to LongmontStudioTour.org.